My next piece is Young Woman from Love at Twenty by Neil Lebute. Sorry, I'm waiting for a call. See, he just texted me. Dexter did. That's him. Dex, I call him. And he sent me this really juicy message about how good it was last night and how much he adores being in my mouth and, you know, all that stuff. But actually, I was at Tula's last night, this bar downtown where I work. Okay, dance. And I haven't seen him since... Tuesday, so um, that's weird. But the hurtful part of it is, the actual bad part of it is this. It's to his wife, Kimmy. That's her name, which really makes you want to barf whenever I hear him say it. Not some other student or lady in town, which I could then understand, because he's quite good-looking and sexy and all that for this older guy. But it's meant for his wife who he's supposed to be leaving. So that means he's lying to me, right? Lying. And sleeping with her. And all that shit that he's been telling me. Assuring me. It's just... Not true. And now I know for like a fact is... Yeah. Dexter's actually screwing me and Kimmy. And God knows who else. And you know what? That just really doesn't work for me. The Dex seems to be doing a little empire building of his own. And I figure that shit has got to stop. Right? So I sent a little message of my own. A few minutes ago to his wife, Kimmy. Seriously, can you believe that name? One sentence. Twenty little words that very succinctly... An adverb I learned from the big man himself explain our present situation and how he tastes in my mouth. You know, that sort of deal. Then, and here's the kicker part. I texted Dex and told him what I've done. Said he's got a few minutes to make his choice. 